Hey guys, Ken Kaplan from the New England Motorcycle Museum here. Today we have another vintage Yamaha. This one an MX250, the motocross version, stripped down just for off-road racing. This was one of the bikes that dominated from that era. And it has the original forks and shocks. The frame is in excellent condition, but it needs a full restoration. Uh, the engine turns over. It has 140 PSI compression, but will not start due to two major reasons. One, it doesn't have a uh, carburetor, and two, there's no spark. Um, they tried a new spark plug and a new spark plug cap and still can get sparks. So it could be something as simple as a coil or it could be something uh, more serious why it's not sparking. But in any event, it's being sold as is for parts or restoration. It has the original tank from 74. It's dented up, but it's not rusted through. So it can definitely be restored. Original seat. Uh, the fenders are off a 360 MX. Junior told me, so I'm not sure. Also the side panels. And the side panels. I'm not sure if there's any difference between the 250 or the 360. Uh, it has a period correct aluminum front number plate. This came from the main cycle collection that we got earlier this year. Uh, this is one of the last bikes from that collection. It has a period correct JT Racing crossbar pad, uh, clutch perch, and a new set of Ori grips. And the, the number plate looks to be in new condition. Um, so uh, let's see, the foot pegs look good. Um, the shocks are the original period correct shocks, as is the swing arm. Bearings are a little bit loose. Like I said, it's going to need a full resto. Great unit for parts or restoration. Uh, the forks look nice and straight. I don't see any um, major pitting on the chrome. A little bit of pitting, as you'd expect for a 50-year-old. Oh, yeah, the cylinder fins are all, all good, uh, as is the head. Um, it does not have a countershaft sprocket cover on there. Uh, the foot pegs are intact and straight. It's got the, the kickstand. Um, is there anything you'd like to add about this, Kenny? Uh, yeah, well Pretty self-explanatory, what you see is what you get. Mostly all there um, by needing a complete restoration. So it's gonna be sold at a low opening bid and no reserve. We can get it shipped very affordably. Message us your zip code for a shipping quote. Roll on, roll off, door to door, licensed, insured, enclosed, transport. So any questions about the bike, call us 860-454-7024. We can store it here if you can't ship it immediately. Um, Good luck bidding, guys, and God bless America. Over and out.